I'm stoked. 16 people are already here. Because we're gonna we're gonna knock this out. No bubbas. Once again, we're live in the camper, but it's me and Bobby's anniversary, and she's allowing me to go live. We are going out to dinner. Um, so it's gonna be like a 30 minute live stream. I picked a really cool topic for the live stream. Is Colorado snowboarding overrated? So we'll jump into that in a second. Uh, make sure you guys ask any questions while you can. Because this is a short live stream, I might not get to everybody's chat. Um, so if you want to drop a donation, feel free to uh, do so. Uh, the blue bar is my Venmo and Streamlabs. You can drop a donation through uh, there and uh, I get 100% of the donation. Or you can drop a super chat, but uh, getting 100% of the donation is super sick. If you guys want uh, all your money to come to the channel, go that route. Uh, and then you also can donate not live like Brett did on Venmo. Um, so if you missed the live stream, but you still want to drop a donation, you can do it that way. And Brett said, snowboarding through you at this point, uh, winter cannot come soon enough. Dude, Brett, you're the man. Thanks for the $5 donation on Venmo. And dude, I'm sorry that you guys can still snowboard through me uh, because, dude, we just did last day on hill here uh, in Timberline or at Timberline in, in Mount Hood. And it was sick. We had a, we had a blast. Uh, now we're off to the coast for family time. A little bit of a family trip. We're going to be doing some cool stuff. I'll still be making vlogs about it. But uh, then we'll be back to Colorado. And then hopefully two more snowboard trips before season six begins. Season six is going to be fire, by the way. We got Flying Brian in the house. What up? And I did uh, check out his footage and give him feedback. And then we got Bristol in the house. Hanging out on the live stream. Hello. She's fed, but changed. She should be content. Uh... You gonna hang out with us? Let's go. Let's go. Family time, Britt says. Yep. So tonight we're gonna go to Zigzags. We went, tried to go the other night and they were closed. Um, so we were a little sad, but we're gonna be getting some pizza, right? How are we gonna do this? You gonna go on these pillows again? You, you do pretty good on the pillows. I know. Tell me about it. She'll probably do better in your arms, honestly. How's that? We good? Big chilling. Oh, well, I'll just rub your belly. Uh, can you back? Can you back something so we know where you are snowboarding for the month? For that month, we are thinking about creating a schedule for this season. I know Cody was talking about it. The hard thing about creating a schedule, though, is it's always changing. And I have so, a crazy wife. I got a wife that's like, no, or like she'll wake up in the next day and be like, hey, let's go here, and I'm like, oh, okay. And so when she's in the mood. We buy the flights, and then once we buy the flights, we're good to go, right, Bristol? Then she can't change her mind. And that, and that she can't change her mind. You already said so. Uh, Chris, how we doing, man? Roberto, what's up? E Dog, Portly, how we doing? Shane's in the house. Ethan, we got Jason. Guys, big shout out to Jason, by the way. Jason took uh, me, Bobby, Roman, and Bristol out to dinner uh, with his family. We had some great talks. They're awesome people. Uh, it was awesome meeting and snowboarding. Uh, you'll see him in a vlog. Uh, we went snowboarding with Jason as well. So shout out to Jason. And dude, the donations are flying in, Bristol. You want to you wanna answer them? Why don't you read Jordan's? No? We can lower this a little bit. Get a better shot of Bristol. Here we go. My little, does she look like me? Jordan, dude, thanks for the $5 donation. How you been, man? We missed you on the live streams. He goes, uh, the answer to the question from snow or from someone who has never been skiing in Colorado is yes, it is too many big resorts. There are a lot of big resorts in Colorado. That's for sure. So Jason saying yes, snow in Colorado is overrated. Um, and this is a conversation, you know, so if you missed this live stream, uh, drop a comment, however you're feeling about it as well. Um, we're going to debate this. Uh, and then Evan Block also coming in with a $5 donation, dude. Thank you so much for the donation. He says, uh, sup, buddy, if you change the profile pic to the one, it's sick. So on my Instagram, go answer the poll. Uh, this was Bobby's idea, by the way. Uh, I put a photo on my story, and I'm trying to decide if I should change the profile picture of the uh, all of the socials would go to that same photo. It's a pretty cool one. We got it at, um, uh, not sugar, uh, Beach Mountain. We took that photo. It's really cool. One of my favorite snowboard photos I think I've ever taken. Uh, and I might make that my profile picture. You guys let me know. And then, um, so, we're going like to keep the live stream short. And I, I, I want to know your guys' thoughts. Do you think Colorado is overrated? Because I'll give my thoughts towards the end of the live stream. 
And I want to know, do you guys think Colorado is overrated? By the way, Evan, I get back on the 24th, and then we should try and get on those bikes, dude. And I will do my best to not flip off the bike. Right, Bristol? My thumb is healing way better than I thought it would, by the way. Yeah, it, it, it's getting better. Flying Brian, dude, thanks for the support, man. I'm not going to mention his name, but uh, let's go. Also, wait till, the, wait till the pro model goggles come out, guys. They're coming. Grandpa's here, Bristol. She just went pee. Yeah, she totally just peed. In the brand new diaper. We'll change your butt in a second. Uh, your video music is getting better. I I like it right now. Dude, Robert, that's Bobby's dad. Liking the, the music track. I've been getting some vibey music, you know? I kind of was going with some of the old school vibe stuff. You know, we're out here with the slush lasher, so why not? He is the best grandpa ever. Can't wait to see him. Um, I know Colorado is better than Connecticut for riding, Britt. <laughs> I, I agree with that. Uh, Shane says, seriously, though, I want to get out there sometime. I was actually thinking about moving there, but California dollars aren't going as far as they used to. Yeah, I don't think anyone's money in California is going far at all. Which is a shame. California is a beautiful state. Look at you. You made a barrel. Dude, I don't even know what that is. It's cool. <laughs> Sam, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Colorado snowboarding is absolutely not overrated. It's amazing. Just need to know where to go, Joey says. Uh, Colorado is better than Northern Virginia. There's definitely better spots. I would I would definitely say Colorado snow quality um, is definitely better than what you're going to find in most places. Colorado's got some of the best snow quality out there. I'm gonna bring you a little lower, girl. I'm not gonna hold you up anymore. Uh, Killing my arm. She's getting a little heavy. Logan says, yeah, because all the Californians already moved out. They made it expensive, just like Utah. Utah's kind of expensive. We've looked at places in Utah. Salt Lake area. Bobby's currently finding tons of houses in Sandy, Oregon, and just sending them my way. Do you like Arapaho? I bought a season pass. Cannot wait. Uh, Static turn, dude. You're gonna see me at Arapaho, dude. Um, I I love Arapaho Basin. It has a lot of has a lot of perks to it, um, especially like early season and late season. I ride a lot of it. Mid season, I don't go too much, but we are definitely trying to rip um, some of the gnarlier things, and we gotta ride that mid season. But it says, who's your favorite musical artist? I see that you use NF and Andy Mino. Uh, NF is definitely my favorite artist for sure. Um, but I, I honestly don't listen to music too much at all. Um, and then I do I have like five songs that I'll like shuffle through and Bobby hates me. And she's like, I don't want to listen to your music. What's up? You not high enough? You want to be higher again? She got some milk coming out. Burp cloth. There's one right here. Okay, you gotta throw it a little better. Hey, give me that. Give me that. Hey, hey, get that hand out of the way. Hey, move that hand. You got slobber coming out. Okay. Oh, you're good. I was about to buy a second pair of Kunos for my second snowboard jacket slash pants, but I'll hold off for when the pro model comes out. Dude, Flying Brian, hold off. Oh, I, I cheated. I showed Brian. Not Brian. I showed uh, Jason. Jason got a sneak peek of the goggles. I've seen them. Bobby's ah. seen them. Bristol's seen them. You like the goggles? They're okay. They're pretty sick. They're okay. If Bobby says they're okay, that means they're amazing. <laughs> Adventure Carlo, what up? L Stacker says, cannonball the like button. Thanks, L Stacker. Oh, yeah, Pigeon. Pigeon got to see him today. Nate, you're just showing everybody now. I'm just so excited. I'm not... I'm done showing people. Selling out. Steven says I'm buying them. Okay, Steven saw them too. Uh. Everybody! <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> uh, they're sick though. Ow. I like sharing. Trust me, I know. 
You can't keep a secret to hold your life. Will Bristol snowboard next season? If she can stand up, she no. will snowboard. I love your anniversary pics on IG. Thanks, Britt. Yeah, so Bobby, it's on my story, did a photo collage. I just posted a video of Bobby being cute, but um, of us for the, over the last seven years, and we've grown, we've gotten older. So the thing is, is I don't have any photos from high school because camera phones weren't a thing. Yeah. But like, we barely have any photos. We have, like, our homecoming photos. Yeah, we don't have many high school photos. But our homecoming photos are pretty cute. Yeah, they were. I was a queen. Was Bobby was homecoming queen. queen. And my senior year, I was homecoming king. And that, so the way our school worked is there wasn't a king and queen. There was only homecoming queen. But then when it was my turn, my class, we didn't have a girl in our class. So we couldn't have a homecoming queen because we didn't have a girl. So we did a homecoming king. And your boy got homecoming king. Right? No, you don't know that, Bristol. And that's how I got Bobby. That's not, we were already so dating. technically, we two were years, dating, two right? years running, we were, we were two years running. Technically, Bobby and I were homecoming king and queen. That's how we roll. We're just the cool people. We're just the coolest people. In our tiny little high school. We were just the nicest people to everybody. Yeah, that's what we were. That was probably the yeah. truth. How tall is Bristol? How tall are you? I don't know. We'll find out the 25th. I'll show you how, how tall she is. Weighs, how tall she is. All right, so she's standing up right now. How tall are you, Bristol? What, like a foot? A little bit. More chunks. Bristol's a little tall. Dude, Steven and Max, guys, thanks for riding with me today. That was a blast. Um, so my thoughts on Colorado snowboarding. Let me double check. Let me check Venmo. Make sure we didn't get a donation. You haven't. Okay. Bobby gets notifications on Venmo. We'll check. Stream apps. Like I said, this is going to be a shorter live stream, guys. I'd love to hang out with you a bunch, but it's our anniversary. Seven year married anniversary. We've been together for 14 years. 13 years? 13. 13 We've known each other for... 14. 15. 16. 16. We've known each other forever. We've known each other... Each other 2005. Well, soon we'll be together longer than we were not together. Now, like, isn't that crazy? That's crazy that we've spent our life together more than we've spent our life not together. Because I've known you since I was 15, so once I turn 30, I've known you half my life. Yeah. And then when you turn 31, you've known me more. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Are you what? stuck in your hand? You hear that? So she's not a binky baby, but I'm afraid she's going to be a thumb sucker. That's fine. Is that fine? I think kids get over the thumb sucking faster. faster. Don't yeah. tell me when the goggles are coming out. I'm not bought. If you don't tell me. Oh, Brian, dude. I don't know when they're coming out. Honestly, we don't have an exact release date. Maddox says, hey, hey what's up, JB? What up, dude? You know the date. I don't know the date, honestly. I really don't know the date when the goggles are coming out. I actually don't even know the... Because I would tell you guys the count, the unit count. I don't even know the unit count yet. But I haven't had time to... I'm, I'm out here snowboarding. When I get back, I get a little bit more time. Jeff O, thanks for the, the anniversary wish. I appreciate that. Uh, will let me buy the first pair now. 500. Brian, don't tempt me, dude. <laughs> don't... <laughs> I'll call Kuno today and be like, get this dude a pair. <laughs> you can buy like three pairs or that. You can buy, they're $80. You can buy no. way more than three. Can we pre-order? No, there's no pre-order. It's the day it drops, be there or they're out. All right, so is Colorado snowboarding overrated? It's hard because Colorado definitely, snow condition wise, I think is one of the best places to to snowboard it's got some of the best snow and for like and it hangs around in some of the best snow it melts off really fast but we get from my experience by far the best powder but the things that are killing colorado snowboarding and kind of making it overrated in my opinion and why i thought of making this topic 
is like the resorts are just getting so busy um and you're, you're waiting in ridiculous lines especially on powder days and like denver just floods the mountains county, every so, so maybe it's summit county if i was at a point maybe it's summit county the riding is overrated because you said telly ride was amazing i'm sure telly ride gets pretty big i don't know telly ride's pretty awesome um but what i what i'm doing with going to all these resorts is i'm finding out like do you need to take a trip to Colorado every year when you can, especially let's say like you're a park rider and you really like riding park. Like, I don't think an expensive Keystone or Copper trip is necessarily the way to go if you go to Minnesota and go ride like Highland or Buck Hill, somewhere that has just as awesome of a park, but you're going to get more riding in. Um, and then like, Think about if you wanted to move to a mountain town. A lot of people want to move to Colorado because they want to move to a mountain town. They want to start snowboarding or like that. But what if when you're kind of a beginner snowboarder, what if you, instead of moving to Colorado, made a move to Oregon, worked for Meadows or Timberline, and you have a season that's from November to August, sometimes September. Like, because the way to get good at snowboarding isn't, I mean, yeah, like coaching helps and things like that, but the true and the most honest, like realistic way to get better at snowboarding is to snowboard as much as possible. The more time you spend on snow, the better you're going to get. And I think a lot of you guys have seen my progression over the last couple of years. And even this season, like you get better when you snowboard. So go snowboard and you're going to get better. So is Colorado overrated for snowboarding? I think trips, like vacations to Colorado are slightly overrated. I think you could take your family somewhere else spend less money and have just as awesome of a trip, if not a better trip, because you can still get into mountain towns. You can still ride awesome places with your family, especially if your kid's young. If you have like a nine, 10 year old and they're not really sending it, like you don't need to go ride Breck. Um, and that's my hopes with the resort reviews um, and what I'm doing with riding every resort in the United States is I want to show you guys how awesome all these are. Like Lee, like Lee Canyon in Nevada. That place is amazing. Like a trip there, especially if you're like a younger person, let's say you're like 26 and you want, you want to go on a trip with your boys and you live in Texas, go to Vegas, spend two days in Vegas, and then the rest riding Lee's Canyon, you have an insane trip. Way better than just going to Colorado. Um, so. You never even thought about that. I didn't, I, I didn't know that was even a thing until I did it. And that's what the best part about all this traveling and what we're doing with the channel. It's pretty awesome, little girl. And we're trying to move to Oregon. And Bobby wants to live. She wants to live in a specific neighborhood in Sandy. If that doesn't happen, we're not moving. Yeah. Because we know Portland's rough. We know that. I don't want to move. Yeah, we'll never. Not, not a specific neighborhood in Oregon. Period. That's close to the mountain, is what Bobby's thinking. Or we just buy a tiny home and put it here. No, that's not she said that's not happening okay help we got 12 minutes left on the live stream <sighs> and we got a donation from jordan another one dude thanks for another two dollar donation jordan thank you so much he says be honest florida has the greatest snow on earth jordan dude we've missed your your i don't know if it's trolling or jokes jordan we missed you man uh florida could have some of the greatest snow on earth if they build a snow dome which New Jersey, big snow, in New Jersey. Dude, if you live in New Jersey, man, you got year round snowboarding now. How sick is that? T shirt. I mean, even just the East Coast, the East Coast is way smaller. Like the states are way smaller. Driving the state to states so much easier than the West Coast. Hi. We spent a whole day driving through Idaho, right? Utah. Oh, thanks, babe. <laughs> Michael in the house, dude, dropping the. Um, the the notorious 1080 donation, Michael, dude. Thank you for dropping ten dollars and eighty cents every single live stream. That's twice a week, four times a month, dude. Support in the dream. Um, thank you so much. Bobby's telling me to make a bottle. Yeah, let's feed her good. So when we go to dinner. 
she chills. I can't like She it seems pretty content. You just were sitting too long or you had her in a position. She didn't really like She was over it. Daddy, Making a bottle on a live stream. Dad, dad life. Hashtag dad life. Why Ooh, I put a little too much water. Just a little bit. Just splash a little bit. But he said, what up, JB? This is Michael with his 1080 donation. What up? Hope you had a great uh, last day on Hill. Cannot wait to see the footage. Yeah, so we are uh, a couple of videos ahead. And once again, this is another reason why Bobby's awesome is like, we have to have three, four days of footage or extra vlogs for the drive back. Um, yeah, that is perfect. And I'm going to have to find a way to to edit or a time to edit those videos. Um, because we're going to be driving, I won't have time to edit and everything. Do we post daily? So being ahead on videos is never a bad thing. And going live like we're doing right now is one way how we get ahead. And also it's one way how like we had a really good night last night. And then it was nice to, to not edit. I didn't have to wake up at four in the morning and edit. I got to sleep in with my family. We had a good time in the camper. And because we're about to do five days of family stuff coming coming up, Bobby was cool with um, that. So you will see Timberline closing day in a little bit. It, like probably... It's still splashy, Anthony. Probably like in the five, six days that vlog will post. Like we got pretty far ahead on, on video. That's what happens when you just keep filming. Like I filmed every single day I was out here, I filmed a video. Whether it was a snowboard video, mountain bike video. Um, I also filmed extra videos. So there's a really good chance. What kind of pizza you want? Ooh, Roman wants pizza. So I've been doing intermittent fasting and I've been stopping eating at seven. But I honestly, I haven't, I had like two granola bars in my car. I haven't eaten at all today. So I'm going to break my time frame, but it's also our anniversary. So you'll, you'll never I be. I had to go live. I had to go live. It's just what we needed for the trip. Mm. But so I'm sorry that the vlogs are posting so late, guys. Yeah. Steven says, look at Oregon City for houses as well. How far away is that? Yeah, we do. We still got to be close to the mountain, Steven. Jen's in the house. What up? You can see my Timberline closing day video. Oh, Pigeon, no self-promoting on, on here. Get out of here with that, dude. Um, Logan says, I visited the end, or I visited, visited the ended up, I visited then ended up moving to Salt Lake. Could not be happier with the choice. 11 resorts within an hour and 20. I, did look I would say we, Salt Lake is a, is a real legit place. We thought about it. Um, you should move to Boise, Idaho. I haven't. Are we? We drove through Boise. No, we didn't drive we through Boise. We didn't, but it's huge. It's a. I've gone to Boise. Town. Yeah, I've, I've gone to Boise because we went to Bogus Basin. El Stacker's near Boise. We were gonna hang out with El Stacker, try to go out, out to eat with him. Um, but then our heater broke, we had to get that fixed, even though we're in the middle of like another heat wave out here. It's so hot. Yeah, thanks for that. John, how you been, man? Good to see you on a live stream again. Jen, thanks for the happy anniversary, by the way. We we're excited to go celebrate. Have you ever thought about success? doing a live stream edit? Like edit a whole video while live? I don't know if people would be interested. Maybe someone would be interested in that. I'd have to like set it. I'd have to do. I'd have to use a different program so you guys can see the screen and then see it. I wouldn't be opposed to it. Letting you guys see how I edit a, Has anyone a video. Zigzags Has anyone had zigzags? That was Bobby's question, by the way, because we are about to. We're about to. I mean, multiple people wrote you on Instagram. About it. We're not gonna move to Oregon, by the way, too, guys, unless we come check it out in the winter too. We gotta see how much it rains and things. So maybe we'll come out to Oregon this winter. We don't have an idea totally, and I feel bad for Cody because he's like, hey, send me where we're going to go. I'll, I'll try to make a schedule. And I'm like, dude, because Bobby was telling me, she was like, hey, I know you want to stay close to Colorado this year. She was like, but next year is the first, like, so season seven would be the first year that Roman is 
in school and it might be better to not travel a bunch while he's in school and stuff. And I'm like, okay. So she's like, so maybe save the close resorts for then. And then maybe this year you travel even more. And I was like, with us, with us, with, um, with us. So we'll figure, we'll figure it out. With us. Colbert says zigzag is great. Cody says zigzag is fire. Cody. I believe Cody. You believe Cody? Yeah. I believe him. Yeah. You've met Cody enough to believe him. Wyatt, what up? Wyatt, are you going to ride with me at Big Snow, by the way? Hi. She's so that cute. Guy say yes. That guy say yes. That guy say yes. Uh, Jason says, shout out to Jeremy. What a nice guy. Awesome to meet. Oh, yeah, dude. Jeremy is amazing. Uh, I called him and said thank you. He didn't show up to the mountain for l h sadly. Uh, I wish he did, but... Um, we need to do something special for Jeremy because he helped us film for the last two weeks, basically. So Jeremy's the man. Um, we really do appreciate Jeremy. His handle... In the upcoming videos, I'll pop up Jeremy's Instagram handle. Uh, go follow the dude um, as a thank you for, for hooking us up with some awesome filming. Uh, he is a good guy. Good guy. He is a good dude. <laughs> they say dude and dad at the same time? Oh, the last thing... Should I shout him out? He's not on the live stream. Who? The guy we called, Sean. Um, I forgot. See, he didn't even come on. Yeah, he was supposed to jump on the live stream to I get told him to get the shout forget. out. I I, I, I did forget until this very last second. No, I was shouting people out. He doesn't even show up on my computer because he doesn't have an iPhone. See, of course this, he doesn't. This is why I needed him. Do you want me to write it? Oh, I need I need his the the link. Oh. Dad said no. Let Jonathan travel. You come to Texas. Oh, okay. We send the we. So we actually for last this for season five we were really thinking about this. Um, was sending like because we needed to move and we didn't know if we were gonna get a house or anything like that. So we were talking about sending Bobby and Roman to Texas with with Grandpa. Um for the whole winter and then i was going to rent out roman's bedroom when we lived in that apartment and then i was going to travel for six months and really knock out resorts but we decided that that wasn't the best move yeah and mean bobby was yeah i don't think that would have worked out at all are you still going to liberty snowflex or are you going to the coast then big snow so we're gonna go to the coast come back and then i think the second week in september i gotta coordinate with greg um, big snow. And I was talking to Bobby about this and she doesn't want me to, she said that she doesn't want to take Bristol to big snow. So it would just be me, um, and the boys going to big snow, not the family, sadly. They went last year and it was a blast, but, um, so they're going to take a year off from going to big snow, but I also want to go to Liberty Snowflex in Virginia. Um, and so she was saying she wants that to be a three day trip. I think it has to be a four day trip. No, I said two day trip. But she said a two day trip and I was like, that's not possible at all. So, um, I got to find a good compromise that makes Bobby happy, um, with those two trips that doesn't leave her high and dry with the Bobby baby. Early. So yeah, she's, she's, she's like, pick your battles. Don't, don't mess up your whole season of traveling for these two things. And I'm like, dude, these two trips are just as important as all the other ones. You got to build the hype for season six. You need to get breakfast at breakfast in the hood. Where's breakfast in the hood at? That sounds terrifying. I was about to say, I don't want to go. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if I want to eat some hood breakfast. How do you feel about Diamond in the Rough? Where, I don't know what Diamond in the Rough is, Danny. Uh, do we got 53 people on this live stream? By the way, guys, for everyone that's here, hello. Um, we are doing a shorter live stream today, sadly. I did answer the topic of this video. So if you just jumped on the live stream and you want to know my thoughts, is Colorado overrated? Go back to the middle of the live stream and I, I do answer that. I'm just checking to see if we have any donations. It's me and Bobby's anniversary, seven years happily together. So we're going out to dinner to celebrate. And dude, Flying Brian coming in with a $20 Streamlabs donation. Dude, thank you so much for the 20 bomb. It says, happy anniversary, bro. Uh, Truly love supporting you. Your family is awesome. You've helped me so much. Cannot wait for season six and the goggles, dude. 
Brian. The goggles are going to change your life, dude. Thank you so much for the $20 donation, dude. That helps us so much. Uh, that's going to the to the pizza tonight. Um, and thank you for supporting my family because that's what you guys do when you drop donations, watch the videos, everything like that. Yeah, you, you support me. I, I make the videos for you guys, but you're supporting my family and you're supporting everyone else in this channel, especially the young ones that can't drop donations and everything like that. Uh, but watching the videos is enough as well, guys. 100% um, of this money goes back into the channel. Obviously, I got to support my family, but... Um, once the family and the, the normal bills are taken care of, it's back in... The, and you guys see it. We're out here in Timberline right now. We just spent a week out here... Rip, or two weeks out here ripping, and now we're going um, to do more trips. Like, it's... Can't stop, won't stop. See, everyone's saying they want pizza. I haven't had pizza in a minute. Dude, what kind of pizza are we... Oh, you going to get that Greek one? You, you wanted the Greek pizza. Mm -hmm. Bobby picked out the pizza. I'm, I'm a... get the hamburger. I've been ex... Ex... What, what's it called? Like, trying new things? Experimenting. Experimenting, uh, branching out. I've been going for different types of flavors in my life. I have not ridden Big Sky, Parker. I would love to ride Big Sky. That was the best video of Roman and Bristol that you just posted. That was the best. What video did I, of, did I post of Roman and Bristol? At the Splash Park? Yeah. Or... You post a video of them. Uh, yeah, I'm about to post a video with them. The zoo. The zoo video posts tomorrow. Zoo video tomorrow, by the way. Jeremy says, Zigzag Pizza is the ish. Don't eat it unless it's pizza. You know what, l -Stacker. All sports all day. What's up, man? I was at the Speedway tonight. One of my cars flipped three times. Man, all sports. That's crazy. Zoo video yet, hubby? No, zoo video posts tomorrow. Is she good to go? Yeah, we're ready to go. All right, family's ready to go, guys. Thank you so much for all the donations. Thanks for a ton of people. I'm gonna start doing this more with the live streams, by the way. Last topic I'm gonna mention is I'm gonna pick a topic for the live stream so we can bang out the the live stream um, with the topic. You should try surfing or river surfing. The Denver and Eagle Glen Water Park. Andrew, I need to learn how to surf first. I would get bodied if I went out there. Uh, but I know what you're talking about, Andrew. It would be really cool. But, guys, thank you so much for hanging out. Uh, oh, the Instagram photo of Roman and Bristol. Oh. When he's talking or how? Oh, that's what he's talking about. Why? I got it on the IG story. That was Yeah, Bobby captured that moment of Roman being cute. Go check out my and Bobby's Instagrams. So if you're not following Bobby's Instagram, by the way, she's almost to 1,000 followers. Get the girl. It's just literally mom stuff. And get the, baby stuff. It's just mom. It's just mom stuff. Get the girl to a thousand. All right, guys. Thanks for all the, the anniversary wishes. You guys are incredible. We're going out to dinner now. Uh, thanks for watching. I gotta keep evolving. Here we go. The Colorado one. If you don't have this shirt, you're missing out. Go snag it. Link in the description. Keep evolving. We'll see you guys tomorrow with uh, the zoo video. Then back to snowboarding. Then back to skating. A skate video coming. Then back to snowboarding. And then eventually I'll get you guys to the closing day hood video, which honestly was the best day. Sorry, Jeremy. I know you weren't there, but today might have been the best day on the mountain because the ski racers weren't there and they groomed the whole mountain. And then so the whole mountain was groomed without ski race tracks in it, Jeremy. Oh, dude, you missed out. All right. Thanks for watching. Keep evolving. See you guys tomorrow.